Hi, this is a Tutor Nick P, and this is Proverbs 257. The proverb today is, someone can't see the forest for the trees. Okay, if somebody wants a screenshot, now's the time. Let's get right into it. You can also see this uh, proverb as one cannot see the forest for the trees, or you cannot see you cannot or can't see the wood for the trees. So you can really see it all of those ways. All right, let's continue. If a person says that someone can't see the forest for the trees, it means one cannot see, comprehend, basically meaning understand, or focus on the whole situation. Uh, because one is preoccupied with minor details. Basically, they miss the big picture by being too focused on small matters. Thus, one is too focused on one or two trees and misses the beauty of the whole forest, basically, or the forest as a whole. So this is what we mean. So uh, one can't see the forest for the trees because you're too focused on just one or two trees. Let's continue. Uh, he, uh, the earliest citation appears in John Haywood's uh, 1546 collection of Proverbs. Yeah, we've kind of mentioned him a number of times. To be honest, if this proverb is in his collection, it means that it was probably around earlier. And he probably wasn't the one who invented it, but he's one of the first ones that wrote it down, that we had a record of it. All right, let's continue. Uh, he used the original version. You cannot see the wood for the trees. Okay. The wood, or today, we would more commonly use the woods. Yeah, we often say woods, like woods and forests. They're very similar. I think forests tend to be a lot larger, but that's what we mean. So uh, the word woods uh, to mean a small forest, basically. So it's the same idea. If you say you can't see the wood for the trees, it's just another way of saying forest. All right, let's go on. All right, and we have three examples to cover this. Uh, her boss has such... Uh, constant attention on small details uh, that she is slowing down and causing chaos to the whole project. Many think she cannot see the forest for the trees. She's too focused on these small details, these small matters, getting everybody upset, and it's causing chaos for the whole project. All right, let's continue. Don't worry so much about that. Uh, it is only a minor issue. If you give this too much attention, you will miss the forest for the trees. Okay, it's another way we may hear it. Well, the third one here, that political candidate claims his opponent lacks understanding of the whole issue. He can't see the forest for the trees. Uh, he is stuck obsessing over less important matters. Okay, anyway, I hope you got it. I hope it was clear. I hope it was very informative. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.